Hello everyone, what is up? Welcome back to another video. And this one is going to be so exciting because it's Art Basel weekend in Miami and literally it's the best time in Miami I feel like apart from swim week but the energy for Art Basel is just amazing <laughs> I'm dressed right now and I'm heading off to my appointment at dry bar that's why my hair looks like this this is my first time going and I don't know what I'm going to do with my hairs yet but I'm really like hyped to see how it is experience it and get my hair done over there so I'm heading over there and then after that I think I don't know what time I'll finish but my appointment is 45 minutes I think they usually all run for that time but after that I'm going to the design district for a pop-up with Chanel and it's so cool I find it looks so nice and I'm vlogging in the car which is so odd I feel like I never really do it but I'm really excited it's kind of um, gloomy I'm, like I'm going for a blowout and it's kind of gloomy so I'm hoping it doesn't rain it's going to be such an exciting day very jam-packed I'm here for it so let's go <laughs> shoes but I have my heels in the car as usual you know my drill already heading off to get something to eat I don't know if I'm gonna make it to the design district so we'll do it okay update I think we're heading out to try and make it to the design district for our appointment but we're lost in this complex we don't know where we parked, so I am going to have a hard time figuring this out. But we figured we would try to make it to the design district. We're like one higher than me, but it's a little shorter. And I'm already short. these plants that they used here they said they're going to replant it in Miami which is so nice so it's not just for the pop-up like they're going to replant these plants and trees which is so nice and I'm so happy we made it because honestly I didn't think we were going to make it but it's so calm in here as soon as we walked in the music was just so peaceful and it's really nice so I'm going to take you guys along with me. It's very simple but very artsy. Love it. We're going to go around and see more of it. But it's really simple and it's it's very like calm. Huh? Namaste. We're walking down now and I wore my comfy shoes because I didn't want to fall. <laughs> and part of it is like, it's not a flat surface so I had to be careful peep Danny 
<laughs> Let's go. Actually, we're hungry, so I think we're gonna get food. I think we're gonna go to Pura Vida. Yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely. Apparently, apparently, there's an indoor section. We were about to leave to get food, so I'm going to flip it and show you how it looks. thing and the walls of Fendi are just like crazy. YSL has like a very hot fuchsia pink wall going on right now so it's very artsy. Just got to Miami Beach and I'm really exhausted. I'm not going to lie. I'm feeling it. The day is taking a toll on me little by little but now it just hit me. Um, I am at um, Miami Beach like I said because I really want to check out this exhibit that they had. It's a pop-up and um, I really wanted a piece of art that they were giving out. It's like a, like a, I don't know what it is actually. I don't know what they called it, but it's like some frames. I think it, they called it, they called it frames, but that's what they're giving out and I want one to put on my coffee table because I feel like it's really cute. So, um, hair is really crazy, I'm not going to lie. We were in so much traffic and we just got through but it's very hectic everything is just packed i feel exhausted i still have something to go to later today and i'm tired i definitely need all the coffee in the world <laughs> it's like I'm losing my voice <laughs> but um, yeah I'm making my coffee and I think I'm going to have a very relaxing Sunday I'm going to put my candle on and um, maybe watch a few videos uh, and then get on with the day but it's going to be a very slow day because I'm very tired and there is my coffee machine that's literally the best thing in the morning I swear I'm doing the holiday blend, so good. Yesterday, I didn't get the prints I wanted from the pop-up on the beach, but I didn't have time to go and walk around and enjoy our basil. It was kind of sad because I had to leave for a holiday party for work, which was so good, and then I came home last night and that was it and now today I think I'm gonna see if I can like maybe make it today I'll try and see but I'm going to make my coffee it's just done it smells so good it's calling my name post coffee I open my blinds so there's a little more light in here I definitely have to clean up change out of like my oversized t-shirt changing and of course there are moving trucks outside so you hear that I have to clean up and I'm gonna start the day I think I'm gonna work out and um, maybe like get like cook and like I don't know I have no idea what I'm gonna do but I think I'm going to work out and yeah we'll see where the day takes us because honestly i think it's just going to be 
a Sunday self-care day. I like doing that on Saturdays as well because I just, it just feels so good. But Sunday is just my rest day, so that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. I also don't know if I mentioned, I got my nails done. I think I did. I think I mentioned it. And I did bubble bath. It looks so cute. And I also got my toes done, so that's fun. The day before, I went to Sephora and I got two things. I got this Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation, which is so good. This is the best foundation I've ever tried. I love the formula. I love how it just literally looks like my skin. It just melts into there. The only thing is that I got the wrong shade. So I got 6.25, but it ended up being one shade too dark. So it didn't match my like chest and neck. So I have to go back and like, see if I can exchange that because they usually let you do that at Sephora. And then I got this, this uh, concealer, which I got it in 5.75, which seemed fine, but I definitely need to change the foundation to just like one shade lighter because it's noticeable. <laughs> and I don't like when, you know, it doesn't match. That's all, that's the update on my little Sephora haul. <laughs> And my nails. Also, I have like my eucalyptus in my shower and it makes such a difference. It smells incredible. Honestly, when it's like steaming, it just smells so good and the eucalyptus just relaxes you. It's, it's amazing. Okay, we changed into a little biker shorts and a crop top. And honestly, I'm really impressed with how my hair still stayed. It looks really nice. Um, it definitely fell. What I got was the Cosmo um, done at the dry bar. It's a 10 out of 10 experience. I love it. And um, it fell a little bit, but it looks so good. It still has a little wave in it. And I really, really love how it looked and it stayed because my hair doesn't hold one wave in it, much less like one cool. It just doesn't hold, but their products are also really incredible because that's what they used in my hair. They used a lot of, obviously everything is like their line, but they use like mousse and like hairspray and nothing. Like my hair feels so soft. Like it does not make it feel, you know, like when you use hairspray in your hair, it feels like, like stiff. Definitely none of that. Yeah, I'm setting you guys down here. I am going to start with my day. Oh, it looks like a little rompo. My outfit looks like a little rompo if you like, you know, if it's like, joint <laughs> but it's like a pants and a shorts i have to clean up so so much i have i just made a smoothie this morning I have to pour out the rest in a glass i usually do strawberry and mango or like lately danny and i have been doing strawberry and pineapple which is so yummy it's so good and um i use water to like mix it up but um yeah we love doing juices and stuff in the day so we're all changed i think i'm gonna go to the gym um, not now. I think I'll go later tonight, but usually when I start like that and I say I'm gonna go later <laughs> in the night to the gym, I never make it. I personally hate going to the gym in, in the nighttime. I love going in the day. Today, I feel so run down. I feel so dead just on the inside. I need so much rest. You hear it in my voice. My voice, I don't know if you could hear it, honestly, but I feel so congested because like I haven't gotten enough sleep and usually when I don't get enough sleep, I feel like this. So it's just not cute. Yesterday was so much fun. It was very hectic. I'm not going to lie off <laughs> running around and traffic because of Art Basel. So when we went to Miami Beach, there was just so much traffic that we were in and I'm sure anybody who's in Miami right now understands what I mean. Is this too low? I don't know. We were stuck for a little, but it kept moving. It's just really busy. Definitely didn't get to stay and lounge around. And t today I think is the last day of Art Basel, but I can't make it today. So it's kind of sad because it goes by so quickly and I'm really happy to see how much like activity there is, especially after last year, 2020, we didn't have Art Basel, but I'm really happy this year it was like very energetic. <laughs> a big laundry day today because it's the end of the week so you already know
so happy because I'm almost done with my laundry and I just have one pile of clothes to wash and I'm putting that now um, excuse my dryer for all like the background noise this is also your daily reminder to drink enough water I literally have the biggest headache and I know for a fact it's because I'm not getting enough rest and I'm not drinking enough water nearly as much as I used to so I just filled up my hydro flask and I'm drinking this and I'm gonna put on a show for now and wait until Danny's done and then we'll meet back up and go for boba. So I'm really excited. Danny is back and we're going for boba tea. So we're gonna go. Um, I'm so excited. Do you know what you're gonna get? Probably like a lavender lemonade. I'm thinking lavender lemonade as well because like the lavender, it's actually like 6.23 and um, I really want to have an early night and the lavender actually does relax me so much. So I don't think I'm gonna get any of the papas in it. I'm just gonna get like a plain lavender lemonade um, for me because like I really do like, I don't want any sugar rush whatsoever right now. If it was earlier in the day, I would take my chances, but it's so refreshing and it's so good and I can't wait. I usually get it with zero sweetener as well because like it just tastes so good by itself. <laughs> Poppers are a must. Always get the poppers. Okay, well, yes, the rainbow poppers are really good. I will say that. Yeah. I I might, don't, I'm just not gonna get it for me. I might get some coffee though. That's that's your grind. <laughs> I'm literally wearing my fluffy slippers. I know they're very extreme, but I love them so much. And peep like bubble bath on my toes. I love it so much. Okay, I did not think this through, but it's actually chilly outside. <laughs> Danny's prepared. I came prepared. <laughs> I'm not. I was supposed to go out on the date to be fair, but I mean, it's okay. <laughs> okay, holiday music just puts me in the best mood. It's so happy. I'm listening to New Music Holiday. New, yeah, New Music Holiday. That sounded weird. <laughs> Okay, we just got um, news. <laughs> it's so good. We got lavender lemonade. I got no papas. A zero sweetener and Danny got rainbow go. pop. It's so good. I just don't want the sugar or any sugar rush of like the sorts, you know, before I go to bed. One, two, three. <laughs> Yay! This 100% still has sweetener in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's still sweetened, but it's still good. Like, I love it. I'll peep the car. <laughs> the lights look so cute. <laughs> Blue. <laughs> you know, I have no pictures with the car. We have no pictures with the car. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so sad. It's so cute. Such a nice evening out. I didn't even mention it, but it's so warm. So luckily I didn't need a jacket. So I'm getting to just like be in my athleisure wear. <laughs> but um, Danny's being a trooper and holding the two, the two lavender lemonades. But, um, ooh, oh but oh, it's, it's closed. Okay, so we're just like walking around looking for somewhere to eat in like this little cute spot <laughs> in our neighborhood. Okay, options. We found my species and shout out to the music in the back. 
shout out to the football on TV. <laughs> of course you're really happy to see that, right? Oh yeah, I got the Chiefs. <laughs> I just fully realized I have like the tea bag in my drink, which is so cool. I've, I've never had that before, but it's, it's like infusing my lemonade as we speak with lavender. <laughs> we just got our food, and Danny got the said ahi tuna, and I got the blackened fish, and it looks so good. There's corn, pickled onions, tomatoes, and we got chips. Ready. <laughs> Dinner was so good. Oh, we got like, I'm stuffed. You're stuffed, right? Yeah. I still have my tea. I, I don't. Still, <laughs> yeah, Danny finished his. I still have my lavender lemonade. And I am so stuffed. We're walking off like dinner. <laughs> Basically, we're walking back to the car, but also walking off dinner, <laughs> which is so nice. And then we're going home and I'm going to get ready for bed. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sleepy after all that big food. I can't sleep. I'm so full. I, I think I ate way too much. I could fall asleep right now. I had, I had way too much too, but I could fall asleep. <laughs>